Who scares you more, Riddler or me? I'll tell you everything. How kind. I am ready to face your final challenge. It's the toughest yet. to be commended, Azrael. You have passed the test. I will contact you when I have made my decision. There is no decision to make, Batman. I am ready now. I decide how this works, not you. Every moment you waste, Gotham falls deeper into the abyss. Make your decision fast, or she will be lost forever. Sir, we have a positive ID on Azrael. His real name is Michael Lane. He was a GCPD officer before he was dismissed due to psychological issues. And then, well, he seems to have disappeared off the face of the earth. That must have been when he was recruited by the Order of saint Dumas. It gets decidedly more peculiar, sir. The Bat Computer has picked up an irregularity in Lane's physiology. I've not seen anything like this before. Upload the data to the clock tower. I can analyze it from there. Right you are, sir.
Sick of waiting here. You come find me when you're ready. Nothing we can do here. Spread out and find him. <laughs> okay, so you learned some new tricks. He's mimicking my voice. Switch channels. I thought I was gonna freeze. Supposed to be the best. You aren't worthy of the training I passed on you. If you were, he'd be no match for you. It's too quiet. Report. I'm okay. Yeah, yeah, me too. Yeah, all good. There's something unusual about Azrael's neurological activity. I'm heading to the clock tower to analyze it on the bat computer. Perhaps it's a sign of disease, sir. Or something worse. What do you think we'll find in Azrael's brain, Bathy? Who knows? Maybe there's an evil court jester in there. <laughs> Sending over the data on Michael Lane now. I'm no neurologist, sir, but I can quite confidently assert that doesn't look like it belongs in one's brain. It's a surgically implanted microprocessor interfacing with the temporal lobe, the region of the brain used for storing and accessing memories. Which memories, sir? Visualizing now. Azrael, protector of faith, defender of purity. The Order of San Dumas has safeguarded Gotham for over 500 years. And it is your sworn duty to continue our legacy. You have studied the Dark Knight for years, learning his every strategy, analyzing his every tactic, perfecting his every move. Now it is time to complete your mission. Seek out the Batman. Prove that you are his worthy and trusted successor. Only when you have won the Batman's trust will you be able to fulfill your destiny. His intentions do seem pure, sir. Are you suggesting these recollections have been tampered with? I am. Alfred, I know this symbol from Arkham City. It's the Order's sacred language. They've implanted markers into Lane's memories to modify his behavior unconsciously. If I can find the other markers, I'll be able to reconstruct the waveform and reveal the message. Scanning that marker has reconstructed part of the waveform. It's working. I can't reveal the message unless I find and scan all the markers. 
Another portion of the waveform has been restored. Almost there. There's probably one more marker to find and scan. That's it. The waveform is complete. This should reveal the message. The Dark Knight stands in the way of our cause. He prevents the evil of Gotham from facing true divine justice. When you have proven yourself, wait for your moment and then strike him down. Take your rightful place as Gotham's new guardian. A guardian wholly willing and relentless in his quest to protect this city. They certainly don't mince their words, do they, Master Bruce? How will you stop him? He won't. Lane. Lane is dead. I am Azrael, knight to the Order of San Dumas. The Order has lied to you, stolen your free will. Liar! You stand in the way of true justice! We're on the same side, Michael. No. No! I know who I am. I know what I am doing. In that case, the choice is yours. Protector of faith, you know what must be done. The blade calls to you, Azrael. It's one true master. Stands in your way. Gotham will be yours. I thought myself the instrument of God, not the tool of man. You made the right decision, Michael. I do no one's bidding but God's. The Order must answer for what they have done to me.